Laundry room clothes dryers are the cause of around 15,000 house fires across North America every year. The good news is these types of fires are fairly preventable when proper maintenance and safety precautions are followed. Vaughn Fire and Rescue Service Deputy Fire Chief Darren Rizzo is here to join us to talk about uh, these fires in our dryers. Good morning to you. Good morning. So what is it about dryers that make them a fire hazard? Today we're going to talk about a hidden danger in your home, a common household appliance, the dryer. Most people don't understand the dangers of dryer fires. What is more surprising is the number of these fires that could actually be prevented. So first we need to take a look at the culprit of these fires, lint. Lint is a highly combustible material, which means that it can easily catch on fire. The first step in keeping your home fire safe is to remove the lint from the lint screen. This will not only reduce the risk of fires, but it will also ensure that your clothes dry faster and you'll use less energy. But what people don't realize is that when you remove the lint, either by hand or using an attachment such as a vacuum, you're actually not removing all of the dangers that are on your lint screen. When you use detergent or softener in your washing machine, and then you put your clothes in the dryer, and also using dryer sheets such as this, what happens is there is a waxy buildup that's invisible that builds up on the screen that the lint sticks to. So what you need to do is you need to put your lint screen in hot, soapy water and use a brush like a toothbrush to brush off the buildup. What you're trying to do is you're trying to remove all of the buildup of lint within the dryer. Okay. Not only do you want to remove the lint within your dryer, you also need to take a look outside of your dryer. So you want to clean underneath the dryer, mm -hmm. behind the dryer, mm -hmm. and if you have a stackable washer and dryer, you want to clean in between there as well. All right, how often are you supposed to wash your, your vent with hot water and soap? We suggest every six months. Every six months, That's okay. Right. Um, what about things on top of the dryer? Is that a hazard as well? Absolutely. We say when you're cleaning around your dryer, make sure that you're taking away any sort of combustibles. So don't leave your laundry basket full of clothes right on top. All right, and I'm going to assume that you don't think we should leave the house with the dryer still going. No, that's our biggest warning for people. So a lot of times when people put laundry in the laundry, uh, in the washing machine, then they throw it into the dryer, they'll go out, run an errand, or worse yet, they'll go to sleep. So our safety message to all of your viewers is to ensure when you're drying your clothes that you do it while you're in the home and while you're awake. All right, Darren Rizzi, thanks for being with us. Important information today. Thank you.